Welcome back. Standard 4MBT5, number in operations in base 10, still multiplying two two-digit numbers. Here's a problem. This is number seven. Check this out. This one is long. Takes up half, more than half a page. This is going to take forever. Or maybe it won't. Let's just start at the very top. Sorry, placing up the phone. There's all my annotating colors. Pencil first. Samantha solves 42 times 13 using an area model. Let's identify that academic vocabulary area model. This is an area model. Solves. Remember, we identify proper nouns and we will put them in blue. A proper noun is like a name, starts with a capital letter. And let's look at all of our numbers. Some of the previous recordings, we have focused on area model. So I'm not going to review a lot of the previous academic language and strategies. We're just going to dive right in the pool. So let's double check, make sure that this is correct. What do I mean by that? Let's go and check expanded form. 42 can be written as four tens plus two ones. Remember, this is ones, tens. The other number is 13. 13 can be written as 10 plus 3. We are expanding it. Ones, tens. Tens, ones. 40, we put the 40 right there. The 2, the 2 goes right below. 40 plus 2 is 42. Let's check up here. 10 plus 3, which we wrote right here is the 13. Area model, we multiply it. Let's start with the 10s first. 40, I'm going to write in this box, times 10 is 400. Two zeros, two zeros. 40 times 3 is this box. 4 times 3 is 12 in one zero. 120. 2, 2 times 10. One zero, one zero. Two times one is two. In the last box, we have two times three. Two times three is six. Okay, so all this makes sense. It works. Samantha, great job. Next step, use the same reasoning. Reasoning is what I just did right there with you. Okay, I talked it out. Went to expanded form. Multiplied it. Did each box. That's what this equals. This is 400. This is 120. This is 20. This is 6. This could be written as 400 plus 120 plus 20 plus 6. So we need to use this reasoning to solve 39 times 17. Okay. Keyword reasoning. Thought process. The way the problem was solved right up above. So you can see the diagram right here. I will move the equation down so you can see the options, but let's keep reading. Which numbers complete the equation? You may use the area model to help you, which is all of this up here. Area model, equation, numbers. I'm going to move the camera down so you can see all of the possible answers. So here's all the possible choices. Let's solve it out. First, once again, let's do expanded form. Right now we're at four minutes. Let's get going. 39 can be written as 30 plus 7. Remember, break it down to 1's, 10's. 17. 17 can be broken down to 10 plus 7. 1's, 10's, 10's, 1's. There's 1, 10, 7, 1's. 
Okay, there it is. See how 10 plus 7's right here. 30 plus 9. 30. Ooh, got to write this correctly. Remember in math, make sure you double, triple check. Everybody makes mistakes, especially me. Okay, so now let's solve it out. This is 30 times 10. 3 times 1 is 3. Add two zeros. 1, 2. Check, 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 check. 30 times 7 is over here. 3 times 7 is 21. 1, 0. Check, check. 300, 210. This box down here, 9 times 10. 9, sorry for the sloppiness. 9 times 10. 9 times 1 is 9. I add a 0. Check, check. Last box, nine times seven is 63. Now here's all the possible choices. Since we're about six minutes already, we don't wanna go for four more, so let's speed this up. 30, where is 30 here? Nowhere, so right away, A is wrong. 300, 300. 210, 210. 90, 90. 63, 63. Did they add it correctly? Three. Nine plus one is 10. 10 plus six is 16. Carry that one. Five, six. Okay, they did add it correctly. All right, so everything is checking off here. It all works. Watch this. 300, 210, 90, 63, 663. There's all the numbers right there. Now, just in case, we will eliminate C. See what is going on with C. 3 plus 9. There is no 3, there's no 9, unless you're missing all the zeros, which we cover. If you underline the zeros and double check the zeros, this is not going to be an issue. And the last one, check this out. Watch how close this is. 300, 300. 90, 90, 63, 63. But one zero is missing. Problem. Major problem. Okay, there it is. 7 times 30 is 210, not 21. So we know the correct answer is B. Hope that helps. Enjoy. Have fun. Keep practicing the area model. Remember, always expand it. Show your work. Don't cut any corners. I was just doing this with my son who's a fifth grader now. He can do it all mentally, but sometimes when he goes too fast, he will make a mistake like that. So take your time, write all the numbers in there, annotate, show your work. Later.